what's up this is JC with Carnage Gaming and today we are checking out Ark now it's not a new game by any means it's been out for a few years but it's new to me so we're gonna check it out and see how it plays now I have spent a little time on it I have went ahead and done a few playthroughs uh, trying to get the hang of what to do so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and collect some materials to begin off with um, we're looking for stone we're looking for thrash we're looking for wood um, anything that's gonna help us to go ahead and get our weapons made and to go ahead and get and to get our uh, first base made. All right, so let's check out the inventory here. Um, see, there's the pickaxe. We want to go ahead and get that made. Uh, but first, let's go ahead and get rid of all this. Now, this is stuff that's for the expansion, which I'm not playing right now. So we'll go ahead and dump this. And you have to get rid of that and this. And we'll keep this. All right, so let's go ahead and find some more materials. And let's go ahead and get that first pickaxe made. We'll just beat the crap out of this tree right here and get some thrash. It looks quite painful, actually. But we're tough. We can take it. Now, I did Google uh, the game to try to find out what the uh, storyline is. Uh, you know, what, what are we playing for? Why are we here? All that kind of stuff. And it, it doesn't tell us anything. It uh, basically just... Um, they're kind of keeping it to themselves. They say there is a storyline. And that you got to play through it to figure it out. So well, let's go ahead and make this. Um, see that only couple, take a couple seconds, and we can go ahead and put some points into our campfire and our hatchet. And I guess that's about it right now. And we'll just go ahead and keep getting some more berries and fiber, and just keep loading up on materials. All right, and it looks like we leveled up again. Uh, we'll just grab some more of this stuff as we go through. And then we'll pull up our inventory menu. And uh, let's see, we got our pickaxe is done. And oh wow, our health is really low. We need to eat some food to try to get that back up. Oop, not those. <laughs> those are knockberries. Those things will uh, put you to sleep. All right, let's see here. We got some points available now. So let's go ahead and put them in melee damage. And that'll open up. Uh, for us to go ahead and get some clothing. Let's get our pants and our shirt. Uh, we got four points left. Um, yeah, we'll get the spear. And let's go ahead and can we craft it? We can't craft anything. Uh, we need fibers. We need thrash. Now we can get thrash by hitting the uh, trees with the pickaxe. So we'll go ahead and load up on that for now. Alright, just a little bit more. And then we'll go ahead and get some flint. Now flint we can get from hitting rocks with the pickaxe. So let's go down here and we'll take out these boulders here. And that's, yep, here we go. We're getting some flint out of these. Some stone. Uh, we'll just get destroy this one. And what the hell, we'll go ahead and beat this one up too. All right, instead of have you guys just sitting here watching me beat rocks and pick up flowers, I'll go ahead and um, I'll finish this. And then we'll be back when we're ready to uh, go ahead and go after our first animal. All right, guys, we got our spear, and this will be our first little victim. We're going to poke him in the ass, poke him in the ass. <laughs> All right, and we use the pickaxe to take him down. You get more meat and hide when you use... Oh, what do we got here? Is he dead? Poke him? Yeah, he is dead. All right, well, we'll go ahead and get him, too. We'll drag him up here so I don't have to worry about piranha coming up and chewing on me while I'm trying to cut him. All right, we'll use the pickaxe again. Same thing, you get more fish and you get more uh, hides out of animals using the pickaxe. All right, so I think what I'll do is I'm going to go ahead and gather all the resources that we need to go ahead and get our first base going, and then we'll be back. All right, so we got enough now. We can go ahead and get our foundation going. So let's see, where do we want to sit it? Um, uh, this don't look too bad. We get it on the hill. It's easy to walk into. And let's see, put it right about here, I guess. Yeah. All right, and let's see, let's put the second one down, and uh, actually we need to go ahead and add a couple more. All right, we'll go ahead and let's see, we'll drop the other two on this side. Uh, let's go ahead and line them up, and one more, make it a perfect square. Come on, work with me here, work with me. There we go. All right, and let's go ahead and we can put our box in the left corner. We'll just sit that as close to the corner as we can. A little bit. Right there. Alright, looks like we're going to need just a little bit more so we can make the walls. So I'm going to grab that and I'll be right back. 
All right, so we got everything now that we need to make the walls. So let's go ahead and get them plopped in place. Uh, let's see, we're gonna put the door on the left or the right. Left looks good. And let's go ahead and where's my walls? Let's go ahead and put some walls up. I think I got enough to go all the way through. Let's see, we need what? Come on, work with me here. And we just need one more. Alright, let's go ahead and get this one up. And let's go ahead and clear out our inventory. We'll go ahead and put everything we don't need inside our inventory box. Uh, we'll get rid of all the berries. We don't need them right now. Um, let's see a campfire. Let's go ahead and place the campfire over in the right corner. And let's uh, uh, this sink the campfire. Hold on, this is the floor. Let's get out of that and try again. There we go. All right, so we'll put some fuel and the food that we're going to cook and turn it on. All right, let's go ahead and let's get our roof on now. We'll bring. Uh, the roof up and we'll put one there one there one here and you know, scoot back a little bit and one there there we go we have got ourselves a home now so what do you say we go ahead and we tame our first animal so i'm gonna go ahead and track one down and then we'll be right back all right i think i see our first lucky victim i mean partner <laughs> oh he's a mean one uh let's see we need to knock him out so, best way to do it is just punch him. Punch him in the head. Knock him out. There we go. Alright, so what we need to do now is open up his inventory. And let's put some berries. I don't have any berries. So we'll put the meat in for now since he's a carnivore. Uh, we need to find some berries to keep him unconscious. So we'll just go ahead and scavenge through all this and look for some uh, narco berries. Uh, we got a few there. Could use a few more. Uh, let's go through all these and see if we can find anything. Uh, it's not looking good. Okay, there's another one. Uh, I don't know if we have enough yet. There's another. Alright, let's just clear out this little area here. There's two more. Alright, that should definitely... That'll definitely help. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, there's a dead animal here. Huh. Well, <laughs> we'll go ahead and harvest him for his food. Not a problem. And let's go over here. We'll open up our buddy's inventory again and we'll go ahead and put the uh, uh the narco berries that'll keep him unconscious and the meat that way when he gets up he'll uh he'll be hungry and that'll help him that'll help tame him and there we go and i shall name you mini me now we'll call you sabbath all right guys i think what i'm gonna do now is i'm going to go find our first mount and then we will be back. All right, guys, it's been about an hour. We are, oh, check this out. Somebody killed it. Uh, we are on the bad side of town. Let me tell you, this is like the bad side of town. Everything over here wants to kill me. Um, like I said, it's been an hour since uh, our last cut. Um, just gathering supplies, having to kill stuff, um, run stuff back to the house, uh, upgrade all our stuff. And uh, we're looking for, it's like a pig. What the hell was that? Oh, that might be him. Yep, that's him. All right, let's, uh, where's uh, Bolo's? We'll use the Bolo on him. If we can hold him still, we can punch him out. And, oh, shit, he moved. Crap. All right, where's my Bolo? Where'd he go? Oh, here he comes. I don't want to kill him. Um... Uh, let's see here. How am I going to do this? What is he running from? Uh, can I make another bolo? I don't have enough stuff. Uh, I can't make anything here. What the hell are you running from? Oh, here comes another one. What the hell is chasing? Whoa, what the frick? Holy shit, it's a crocodile. Uh, where the hell did it go? Did I kill it? Okay, that was like spooky as shit. Looked like something out of a freaking horror movie. Alright, 
let me see if I can find this guy again and then we'll be back all right it's been about 20 minutes I haven't found him but I found another one if I can get up here uh, see I don't think these flies will attack me as long as I don't attack them so let's go ahead and let's get the bolo back out and let's see if we can hit him this time with it there we go all right now we should be able to just see he kind of looks like a pig punch him in the face oh bloody his eye bloody his eye kick, kick his ass kick his ass there he goes all right now he's a he eats fruit so let's put all our fruit in our well, knockaberries first and then let's go ahead and put oh, hell let's just put all our fruit in here so let's wait we gotta carry and that's about it now we just gotta wait and he'll be ours in just a little bit all right so he should be taming here in just a little bit and there he is all right now we will go ahead and rename him sabbath since uh, my other one died and now we have a rideable mount so we'll go ahead and put his saddle on him and let's see is there anything else let's take him for a ride all right well, i'm gonna go ahead and ride this puppy back to the house and we'll pick it up there guys well he ain't a Ferrari by any means uh, very slow uh, but uh, a little faster than walking so I'm happy with that I'm sure he's only one of many mounts that we're gonna tame I'm definitely looking forward to taming the uh, flying one that's gonna be, definitely be cool be able to fly around this map but until then Sabbath is just gonna have to do all right guys well I think I'm gonna leave it here um, if anybody's got any uh, tips or anything uh, go ahead and put them in the comments for me uh, let me know what you think about the game and as always if you enjoyed the video hit that like button and subscribe to help out the channel till next time guys catch you later